Good morning. Have a nice day, friends. Welcome to our YouTube channel, Mukham Institute. Our today's topic is principles and elements of design. The question is why should we use design principles? The answer of this question lies in nature. Nature operates by the rules of geometry. Geometry forms the essential base for design. Design principles themselves are based on geometry. This is the Fibonacci series. It's also called the golden mean or the golden ratio. This volume can be found in everything in nature. In these images, you can see how the Fibonacci series and the volute can be made over a rose and the formation of a worm. The design principles are pattern, contrast, emphasis, balance, scale, harmony, rhythm, unity, and variety. The elements that are used for creating a design are line, color, texture, shape, value, space, voids. This is an example of how pattern is made in design using contrast and geometry. This composition is an example of emphasis in design. The chessboard is a good example of contrasting squares placed together to form a composition. The butterfly on the right side is a good example for contrast. Ripples and waves are a good and a classic example for rhythm and movement. The rock formation on left is a good example of balance. On the right side, the flower you see has balance in color. Scaled down examples of classic vintage cars are a common toy. This is how you can easily understand how scale operates. This is an example for harmonious use of orange theme. Yellows, orange, osher and pink have been used judiciously. Symmetry is the most commonly used design principle. On the left, you can see how heart, star and our flower pattern have been divided from the center and everything is same. The image on the right side shows symmetry, asymmetry and radial symmetry. Line as a design element is quite obvious in the zebra. Here you can see how color has been used to create emphasis. Square has been used effectively as a shape for making the composition. Here is an example of how texture has been effectively used in fashion design. Please like, follow and subscribe to our channel and watch the second part of this video which will be coming up soon.